Hey, I'm Skyler. If your iPad is stuck on the screen that shows the Apple and it's just not booting up beyond that, you may have to put it into DFU mode and use iTunes to restore it. First, try restoring it normally just by connecting it to iTunes and then clicking the restore button. If that doesn't work, Make sure you're connected, obviously, with your sync cable. Uh, any type of restore won't work without this process. What you want to do is hold down your sleep-wake button, this one, and your home button at the same time until, and this is the trick, until the screen goes black. Then let go of the sleep-wake button, but not the home button, okay? You'll know it's worked when you see the, well, I'll just show you. So I hold these two things down and the iPad will turn off in a second. Bam, okay. Now let go of the sleep-wake button. Got the timing wrong. If you see this, you're not in DFU mode. So let's try again. Hold them both down at the same time. Let go. Oh, didn't get it again. So the trick is about 10 seconds or so. That's where you want to be. And you'll know that you got it right when it says that it's detected an iPad in recovery mode but does not show anything on the screen. And I got it right this time. So now the iPad is actually in recovery mode, but the only indication of that is here in iTunes. There it is, it pops up. So now we see blank screen, iTunes has detected iPad in recovery mode, so click OK, and then you click restore, and that's going to actually extract the entire operating system, all of the software, everything you've ever done on it, and reinstall a brand new version of the operating system. This means, however, that you're gonna lose all of your data, so be forewarned. Thanks for watching, I'm Skyler, and good luck.